Good morning, everyone. I'm going to spend the next few minutes talking about how we can all work together to bring the open cloud to the enterprise. HP's business is the enterprise. And when we ask our customers what they like about the cloud, they talk about the agility and lower TCO benefits that they get from having elastic infrastructure available at their fingertips. But they also tell us it's early days with cloud adoption. And when, when we ask them how we can help, they often talk about three things. Having an open platform that is enterprise grade and offers deployment choice. And so we decided to focus our platform efforts on those three things. First, let's talk about open. You know, at HP, we actually believe that open is all about both open standards and open source. And it's important to note that we don't just think about it tactically, like how can we take other people's open source and incorporate it into our product, but strategically. That is, how can we work together with a broader community to go create the next generation cloud platform together? And for the underpinning of our platform, we chose the OpenStack project, which was a great choice. In its four years of life, it's enjoyed a lot of momentum, tremendous amount of momentum. 100,000 100, commits plus across over 2,000 developers uh, coming from 200 different companies. And we've been in it since early days. We've um, been in the top two or three contributors over the last few cycles. And in the Juno cycle, this latest cycle, uh, we're number one in both commits and reviews. And we actually run the OpenStack project's CI infrastructure. So Garrett, Jenkins, Zool on top of our public cloud. So we're all in on OpenStack, and really the proof in the pudding is that 99% of the engineering work that my team does happens upstream. So we've talked about open. What do I mean by enterprise grade? For our customers, that, mean having, that means having security and HA and scale all baked in. And that's, that's what we do at HP. That's, that's part of our DNA. And so in addition to making general purpose contributions into OpenStack, uh, we focus on these three things as far as um, you know, making OpenStack better. And I could give you a lot of data points, uh, but the most salient one is that we actually run one of the largest OpenStack, uh, OpenStack deployments in the world. Um, it's a cloud that runs over thousands of nodes and multiple regions and multiple data centers. And we run it, um, you know, we get all of this, this, uh, this experience running OpenStack at scale that we plow back into the OpenStack project upstream to make OpenStack better. So our product line is called Helion, and we have two products there, the Helion OpenStack product and Helion development platform. Both come in two editions, the uh, free edition we call community edition, and the paid edition we call commercial. Helion OpenStack Community Edition ships every six weeks and is very close to upstream. You can't find a more vanilla uh, OpenStack distribution. We even use Horizon, the console, and uh, O, the native deployment system in OpenStack. So that's a great way of getting started, getting, uh, getting started with OpenStack. The commercial edition ships with every major and minor OpenStack release and is optimized for, you guessed it, security, HA, and scale. And finally, uh, the development platform takes the Cloud Foundry PaaS layer and makes it work really well with OpenStack's application services. So the Trove database as a service, uh, messaging as a service, and so on. We're committed to Cloud Foundry at the PaaS layer and having a great binding with OpenStack at the IaaS layer. And finally, we do offer deployment choice. You can take Helion and run it in your data centers on top of any hardware, not just HPs, of course. You can... Um, rent a dedicated rack or more in one of our 80 global data centers, or you can run your workload in the HP public cloud if you don't mind having it intermingled with other people's workloads for the TCO benefits. So I told you about Helion. Let me tell you how to find out more about it. We just launched our Helion developer network, which is our developer portal. You can go there to download our community editions of both uh, the OpenStack and development platform products, and you can find all the typical things that you find on developer portals there. And finally, you can come visit us in our booth, booth 301, 
and uh, attend the two talks that we have on Helion, both at 11.30 today and tomorrow by Manav Mishra and Rajiv Pandey, my good friends and colleagues. With that, thank you very much, and I hope you have a great OSCON.